Now at 6, the Richmond community honoring the service of Officer Sierra Burton. City officials say she has now been taken off of life support this morning. For more than three weeks, Burton has been getting treatment at a Dayton hospital after being shot during a traffic stop. CBS 4's Courtney Spinelli shows us how she's being honored in Richmond tonight. This afternoon, Officer Sierra Burton's cruiser was moved here onto the lawn of the Richmond Police Department. On it, the word hero, something we've heard over and over over these last three weeks. Canine Officer Sierra Burton's fight, as honorable as her four years of service to the Richmond community. She did her work. She was an amazing officer. She did a real good job. Like many others, Dana Schaefer is remembering Burton for the respect she showed her. Schaefer says Burton responded to a break in at her home. She calls Burton a beacon of kindness. When she came, she was with the other officers, and then when they, some of them left, she stayed there, talked to me, and talked a little bit. Officials say Burton wore her shield with pride. Badge number 140, her canine partner Brev, always by her side. Yeah, obviously, uh, these situations are extremely tragic. Burton's cruiser now on the front lawn of the Richmond Police Department. Somber moments as the first bouquet was laid down. It affected a lot of people, I do know that especially her co-workers, and I give prayers to every single one of them. Tear-filled showings of support continuing Thursday afternoon. About an hour away in Dayton, her brothers and sisters in blue, joined by Ohio area law enforcement for Burton's Honor Walk. To try to be a pillar of support for the family, uh, for the agencies that have been here, uh, everybody that's been affected. Officer Burton will continue her service to others through the gift of organ donation. The support from all over still needed for loved ones in the department. It's something Dayton's FOP president knows all too well. It's a combination of emotions that is hard to express. Burton was said to be married just nine days after she was shot. A close friend of the couple says they were each other's person, the happiest they've ever been. Looking forward to their future, now ripped away by someone else. A lot of turmoil you're dealing with. At the same time, there's a lot of peace. You know, uh, something terrible is coming to an end. Uh, people are getting peace. Uh, now we're just asking for... Uh, God support, the community support to allow people to uh, process what's going on. Many community members are wearing bracelets that say Sierra Strong 140. Pins with a photo of Officer Burton and canine partner Brev on them. They say her service, dedication, and heroism is something they wanted to come out today and honor. Reporting in Richmond, Courtney Spinelli, CBS 4 News. To see more of our coverage and the very latest on the life and legacy of Officer Sierra Burton, head to our website, cbs4indy.com.